Well, I just want to do a little update on the van. Um, we ended up trying to get it started today. And, well, let's just say we got the crap scared out of us. Um, hang on, I'll pop the hood and let you see it some more. What had happened was, is while we was trying to start it, it ended up catching fire on us. And uh, she was wanting to crank a little funny. I'm scared to try to start it again. I smell gas real bad. Probably shouldn't have this cigarette lit over here. Let's uh, let's put the cigarette out. And uh, all right, cigarettes out. I'm just holding on to it. I don't fall going across here. But uh, let's let's raise the hood and uh, let's raise the hood now. Let you see what's under the hood here, what we had to do. All right, well, here we are. Um, I got the hood open. Uh, what happened was, as I was cranking it, trying to get it to start, and it went to start, and then it made a real loud like clunk noise and backfired real hard. And when it did, I seen a ball of fire come up out from under the hood. And it brought back some memories of the Camaro, um, which I have a little video clip that I'll put up at the end of this one of the last time the Camaro was ran and uh, everything. But we're going to have to start looking for another vehicle because I'm scared to even fool with this one any further right now until I get a fire extinguisher or something. Uh, I think it's jump time and caught fire when it did. It, it, it was mostly on the driver hand side right here. Uh, it, it was leaking up pretty high. And I want to thank my wife, Tori, and my friend, Sherry, for helping me put the fire out. Because I don't think if it wasn't for y'all, I probably wouldn't have been able to do it myself. Uh we caked some snow on it and my wife she went in the house and got some water and brought out for me and I'm gonna have to clean some stuff out yeah I gotta fix that gutter too cause that's starting to fall loose from the house now that ice is pushing it back it's gotten pretty bad I'll get some better angles of that but let's 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 flip around here and look at the van as you can see we had to pack it full of snow here <laughs> just put the fire out the fire was right here and uh it burnt some of the wires down in there some of the vacuum lines as you can see right here is one that's rope now let to make sure that none of this melts and uh, goes down in the parts of the motor here which there's some snow sucked down into the intake that's not good so hopefully it ain't too bad. <coughs> but we can get a better look at the fender now. That's banged up pretty bad. There's 
so she's pretty nasty so hopefully I can get this van straightened out before we have to take off go back down for the bone marrow transplant uh, if I can't get it straightened out and I can't get another vehicle I don't know what my plans are on trying to find another vehicle because I have no help um, I, don't, I don't know what to do at this point I'm trying like crazy to get everything straightened back out but it's not going for the best of my interest as you can tell the van has really messed up on me big time it's nothing little this time it's it's pretty big and well the snow's still hanging around it ain't went away yet uh, I wished it would go away cause it never fails your vehicle breaks down on you tires up when it snows so if y'all would feel free to comment and hit the like button subscribe hit the ring of the bell in case you're new to this and let's let's try to get at least I want to say a minimum of at least five likes on this one I want to see if I can get five likes I'll start it out low I'm not gonna jump major I just want to see if I can hit at least five likes so if you would smash that like button and I'll upload some more videos tomorrow uh, we will mess with the van some more and see what we can figure out and I'm gonna see about trying to find some transportation of some sort cuz I gotta get out of here I hate being cooped at the house not being able to get out do videos for y'all and stuff uh, let's go ahead and cut to the video clip of the Camaro and then I'll show y'all the gutter that I have to fix and everything and let's go ahead and cut right here to the clip of the Camaro last time it was ran I know I said 98 but it's actually a 96 I messed up on that part you'll notice it and then I'll show the gutter how bad it is and feel free to leave comments of uh, something else that y'all might be interested in me trying to do or any ideas of what could be wrong with the van don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button later Everybody ain't seen in a while. The old 98. Come here. Set another gas button. Leaving. Sad day. Sad day for the old girl. 